Hello and welcome to some Sea Open at Darlington. Love Darlington. Glad to be here. We got ourselves a night race here in the trucks. Very early in the week here on Monday. But we've got ourselves a nice strength of field. 3.4. I wasn't sure if we would because there was a surprisingly low number of people signed up at first. And then I guess maybe the other race before this one got finished and like a ton of people poured in. <laughs> I'm not sure. But uh, it really picked up and now we got a 3.4k. So, gonna be a tough field I think overall. Especially with our uh, free setup out here. Try to get on the <laughs> It is the latest OSR setup as usual. And uh, it's loose on the gold tires, but overall it's maybe a little bit tight. A little bit understeery. So I'm not sure how it's going to be in you know, a long run. But we'll see. Um, I'll give it my best right here. See if we can get qualifying. And One more lap. Hopefully we'll have ourselves a good clean race. Get some patient drivers around us. That'd be really nice. I feel like I, uh, well, famous last words, but I feel like I can keep it clean myself. Keep it off the wall well enough. And hopefully be there at the end. And a tenth in the second lap. Isn't that be much of a difference for us? Don't think we're all too fast. That's a little disappointing. Uh, I was, I'm a little bit faster than that. I guess I was just a little nervous to uh, push it any more than I did. Uh, don't want to hit the wall and invalidate your lap. But I guess that's okay. 405, my best is a 207. But I don't think I can just pull that out of my hat anyway. So I'll take it. We are the five truck in this one. I up the tape just a tiny bit, and that's why I had the dash up, but I don't think that's going to be a concern. Tires fall off pretty quickly, so you're already slowing down the pace before too long. So I think we should be just fine. Hasn't even gotten into uh, any sort of warning zone at all. So honestly, I'd probably do it a little bit more, but I'm not gonna take myself out of it by blowing my engine. No reason for that. I'll trust that OSR guys have a good general idea of where the tape should be. I'm gonna practice pit entry. A lot of people like to enter from three and four. I kind of just generally like to get off the track if I can and just do this. Watch your speed limit in the pits. Yeah, just do this, speed. <laughs> but, uh, hey, actually, that didn't count as uh, speeding, so. Obviously, I pushed it pretty hard there. I would be a little bit more careful during the race. Okay, Colton, but even that I wasn't a black flag, so there's that. A little high. I just prefer Bob doing Bob. it like that, because, again, I'm not on the track, and I don't have anyone flying up behind me not knowing I'm pitting or something or whatever. Even if I say it, maybe they don't have chat on or something. Just uh, being able to pull down from there seems to get the job done, and I don't think it's... I mean, honestly, it seems pretty fast. In the past, I've actually gained quite a bit of time doing that on other people, but who knows what the actual optimal way to do it is. Ooh, it's kind of a stinky lap, wasn't it? I was looking at eighth. It looks like so many people are not qualifying, though, unless they're just waiting. Well, they can't wait much longer. Hmm. Got someone doing the start in the back thing, I guess. That glitch. Interesting. I would think people would want track position on a track like this, but maybe they anticipate people being really aggressive. I'm just worried that the people that are going to be aggressive are the ones that didn't qualify. Hmm. Oh well. One left to green. Line up on the outside. Next session Close last lap up. I don't know how well I'm gonna be able to save tires. It's so difficult to do here. 
effectively. I'll, I'll do my best though, try not to be too hard on entry and try to, uh, you know, be gentle on the throttle, all that good stuff. We don't have enough data for that. Got my crew chief ready. Brake bias down to 60, I believe I had it. So pretty low for the truck. Reasonably so, I'm, I'm sure other people might do it lower or whatever. Seems to work for me. I just hope we don't have people trying to do something dumb. You know, three wide kind of nonsense. At 14, it was really fast. He was uh, one of the fastest times in open practice beforehand. I'm gonna watch out for him. I'm surprised to see him as the 14, because the speed he had, I assumed I'd come in here and he'd be one of the 6,000 eye reading guys. <laughs> Maybe he's got himself a real good truck today, or maybe he's just really good at Darlington. No idea. But if he's fast, I'll make it easy on him. He's going to be starting on our inside over here. Recognize a fair number of names from racing in the Open Series NASCAR yeah, races. You have three additional sets of tires for this race. Smooth and have a good run. Hopefully I'll be able to keep it under control. These first couple uh, laps are usually pretty darn scary because the tires are cold. So you can get out of control really easy and you're often in some uh, precarious situations as well because you're side by side or you know entering a corner a different way. And so it's really easy to find yourself sideways if you're not careful. I've been there before. So uh, I'm gonna try to avoid taking myself out of this before it even starts. Generally a good idea. 80 laps, so got some time. Tire wear a big thing here. I just barely have any idea of how to save tires. Other than the basics. Only one lap to green here at Darlington, so I better be ready. Got restart zones, that's yeah, right, so we're gonna have a restart zone. Alright, car is off, be ready. Back to what we're due. Green flag, green flag. A little bit questionable. Okay, hi. Clear. Car inside. All right. Pick where you're gonna go. Clear. Okay. The yellow flag is out. Now we gotta put yellow. That sucks. Oh, we're spinning under yellow. Wowzers. Hell of a night. Race car is out. Pits are closed. Race car is out. I think he saved it though, so we're not actually gonna get that spot. That was close. You shaved that? Wow. Yeah, he was real sideways. That's pretty well done. We got lots of apron down here. But, uh... You had the position when the yellow flag came out. Nope. Still had to be corrected. By about six Catch the nine. Car. Catch the 14. Get up there. You can fall back. You earned that. Pit road is now open. <laughs> He's kind of lucky that caution came out, unless him lifting off for the caution is what got him sideways. That's what I was talking about, man. These, uh... When you got these cold and tires, we we got the it looked like he was on that low side. You find yourself in a different spot on the cold tires and it can really snap on you. I don't know if that's exactly what happened to him, but... Looked like me in a previous race. Same thing happened to me exiting too. Just snapped on me early. Out of nowhere and it was very, very difficult to catch. Pit road is closed. We're under caution. Pits are closed. The seven's passing on our inside. Half up, seven. Car. What the heck, man? I'm saving a little bit of fuel. Because why not? Not sure what you would want to do for strategy here. 
I mean, obviously now we got some caution laps to consider. Pretty quick caution though. Look, we're already two to green. We're gonna be coming to one yeah, green. I don't know how I kept it off the inside fence there. That was crazy. What do you mean? Come on, I know how you kept it off because you're goddamn real, man. I try. We're on the outside this time. Where did I start? Was I the outside? I think I was outside Why already. You need to keep what am I talking about? Man. My head's in the clouds. Always do. Pretty sure this is where we started. One to go. Next time by. Line up on the outside. Makes sense. We got only through like one corner. Sixteen almost got the wall. <laughs> Hundred pacing it looked like. Get a pretty good launch from second gear. I'm, I don't think you want to mess with first gear. It seems like that would be way too short before shifting. I haven't really tested it too much, but I'm just gonna keep second gear and be happy with that. Hopefully we can get single file. Got a little bit weird there in turn one. Get ready, going green. Hopefully no more cautions. Whatever happened back there must have been on the racing surface. Usually, uh, Rex get off the get off the track here pretty easy and onto the apron. Not very many cautions. Green flag, green flag. Again, <laughs> the And learned, I guess. He was just really slow out of that corner after he passed me, so I'm like, okay, I guess I'll cross him over. That did not do anything good for me. But P10, that's fine for now. I'm happy with that. A little bit of a gap behind. Yeah, not so much. Only 0.6. You've just done a 29.8. The car ahead is just done a 29.8. Mm, side by side, let this sort out. Okay, it's getting loose. There goes any semblance of gap we had, and then he's gonna cut right in front of me. Ooh, we are really cutting it close here early on. But I'm not challenging it, I'll back off, let it happen. Should be saving tire anyway. Trying to get it on the right rear as much as possible. Breaking it plenty enough in the corner. Feeling good though. This is just such an amazing track. It's just fun to drive. It doesn't even matter if you're around anybody. You can just run laps here. Or at least I can and have a great time. All by myself. Yeah, lots of room behind us, that's for sure. Watch 
Beach water temperature is looking a little high. Water temperature a little high, it says. Doesn't look so bad right now. But there's a reason it's up. Beach. Keep an eye on it. I got on the right rear pretty good there. It's pretty fast too. Made the last lap at least. I think turn three is going to be a big key in uh, saving tires. Just how hard you enter. I could be wrong. But it makes sense to me. Kind of a big braking zone. You just don't have to play, on Play a big factor in how uh, your long run goes. Man, almost two seconds behind us. I love it. Really enjoy being able to take the corners how I want and not have to worry about being pressured. Your last lap time was at 30.0. I have won this combo before. In fact, it was a great battle with the four car, or the four truck up there. Uh, he was catching me fast late in the race after a green flag pit stop. And I was wheeling it, <laughs> trying to keep ahead of him. That was a great race, great battle, and he was about one lap away from catching me. That's a fun one. That's on the channel somewhere. If you were interested in that one actively having people click away from this video right now. It's probably not good YouTube, but I guess at, at least it would be another one of my videos if someone wanted to subject themselves to that. <laughs> Can you tell I'm my biggest fan? The 10 car's kind of getting a little bit of that gap back behind us. He's pretty good. I've had good races with him before as well. In fact, it's usually him saving tires well and then catching me later, so that might be what's happening again there. But I don't feel like I've hurt the tires all too bad. I'm just trying to race to a, a decent pace right now. Thank you. And, uh, should be doing fine. Oh, is that lap traffic already? Must be somewhat damaged, I guess. Uh oh. Uh oh. Give him all the space in the world. McCoy, it's down on the apron. What's happening there? Is that a temperature issue? That's the guy you got loose under caution earlier. He's way off the pace all of a sudden. Maybe he smacked the wall. That's interesting. I thought that was a lap truck at first, but oh, that's for position. Very interesting. tight there, that wasn't great. At least I noticed it before I put myself on the wall. Keep the truck clean. Keep it clean, keep it happy. You're gonna need it for a little while longer. No Ross Chastain moves yet. <laughs> Although I guess that would be more of a, uh, who was it that trended at Darlington not too long ago? Is that Kyle Larson? Might have been. No, we're not quite there. Now the guy in Scott Speed again. You really must have just had to uh, cool off the engine or something. Interesting. It's getting tighter, that's for sure. Trying to be patient on throttle, get some rotation mid late corner. This nine would probably come past me if he's uh, he's okay now. 
ready to go. Seems like he's definitely got more speed through three and four. That's what I was kind of saying. I feel like the cars or the trucks are just a little bit tight set up. I would prefer it a little bit looser maybe. Even though it's scary loose on cold tires, I think I would prefer to have it looser once you get a few laps on it. So I'm not thrilled with how it's driving, but it's serviceable. We're here in the top 10. I think the 10 has really good saved tires. He's been moving. But he's on his way. So we'll have to let him by when he gets the nose on us at some point. That's how you have to race here at Darlington. Just gotta let him go. So you not want to be too wide through the corners if you don't have to be. I would say is generally how it goes here. You can see you have a ton more speed through three and four right there. I just hope he's smart about it. Gets a run at the right time and uh, sets it up. Oh man, this truck is tight. That's terrible. There's no bite in the middle of the corner there. Inside. Yeah, this thing's not turning, man. Still inside. Clear. Just gonna ease off, let him by. The nine will be on his way as well. P9, you just done that's 1.7. Switch this thing just a little looser. But I'm not sure if I would even want to loosen the truck during uh, pit stops. Because I haven't practiced what it'll feel like in those conditions. And I just, I don't want to wreck myself or anybody else. I don't know. I'm probably just making excuses so I don't have to look up where, how, what the correct direction is to make the truck looser. Might have been overdriving a little bit, given the current state of the truck. So I'm going to try to stay on top of it. Alright, not so bad. Got some green in that lap. Ooh, almost got up into the wall. That wasn't great. I feel like normally I get some more bite in the middle of one and two right there, even with the tires wearing a little bit, but it's just really pushing. It doesn't feel too great, unfortunately. We're holding on though, like the nines not past us yet. I think they lost a little bit of steam. I think they're side by side behind us actually. It's going to be tempting to come in early, but you uh, want to have a decent truck at the end of the race, too. So, you have to be smart about it. Deal with the uh, tight car for a little longer. Probably pit about lap 44, maybe? After the immediate caution early on. It's probably about halfway, right? Maybe we're just coming at 40 to do a little bit of an undercut. Maybe that's the way to do it. You know that the fresh tires are going to make you crazy fast, that's for sure. Side by side up ahead, I'm not sure if that's going to help us catch up to them at all because I think they're both faster than me right now. Got the 11 on the way. Yeah, 
maybe come in about lot 41 or so. I think that'll be good. Do a tiny bit of an undercut. Maybe gain some uh, track position. got to hang out just a little while longer. Let this uh, truck survive. Take it. Ten is taking the spot. Thank you. Got two guys coming up on us back there. The guy maybe let him by back there, so the guy that was catching me let somebody else that is going faster by, which I assume means that that person's going to catch me even faster. And that uh, seems to be true because it's point three back. I feel like he's going to get bigger in my mirror still. Stuck his nose there. Not quite yet, though. Not quite ready to let him by yet. Last lap we were a little better than him in one and two. We'll see if that happens again or not. Okay, Colton. Cup times are pretty consistent. Is he gonna run in the back of me or? Just set up a pass on exit. Almost to our pit lap. There he goes, he should get it this time. Inside. Still there, hold your line. Clear. The last lap time was at 31.7. Car inside. Clear inside. I'm passing him. Just setting up the exit of my corner. Obviously not going to stick my nose in again. No reason for that. Chance right now. It does benefit us to hold them back a little bit because these are the guys we're going to be racing for a position later. So I will be a little annoying. I'm not going to be unreasonable, I don't think. I hope I'm not being unreasonable, but, you know, I'm going to race my line, and if they aren't able to get around me the way they set it up, then they just got to set it up again. I feel like that's... that's okay, right? <laughs> I don't know, maybe I'm just a big jerk. Eighteen's flying. Mm. 
so tight. The car is so tight. By that I mean truck. This guy's gonna fly Good around me. Guard. Still there at the bottom. Clear. Okay. Yeah, move on. Okay, we're halfway to the finish. Okay, Hunter, that's half distance. One of the history. Eight, 60, laps of fuel left. You've just done it. Speed limit is 45 All right. miles per hour. Okay, we'll fill you to the end. That'll do. Coming in a little bit early, but that was the plan. I trust this place's uh, ability to stay caution free. Five, Especially when people get spread apart. Three, two, one. Right here. 6082. Eh, not too surprising. There's only so much you can do at Darlington, I feel like. I'll try a little bit harder this time, though. Okay, go. Okay, Colton. You're engine temperatures are okay. All clear on engine temperatures. I hope that was a good pit entry. It felt a little bit slow. Hopefully acceptable. More people heading in. We're gonna be zooming. And we'll see how it shakes out. Where were we before we came 17. in? Like eighth or something? I never pay attention. Ooh, cold tires, gold tires. Frigid tires, Arctic tires. Oh, this is not what I wanna see. Five zero seconds. Clear up, Colton. I did what I had to do there. That was a lot of time lost, though. P15, the quickest right now. Not that time was 30.1. That head's got fresh tires, not as fresh as mine. But generally fresh tires. He's going to go, I think. Car inside. Get clear. Thirteen. in the face. That was a twenty-nine point seven. Realized I was talking while I did that. <laughs> you can have it eight up here. I meant, I meant to do just the silent thank you, but I'm here babbling in a thank microphone you. to myself. <laughs> I gotta remember not to just say stupid garbage on the mic. Listen, there's a lot of things to keep track of at once. Here, right? P12. But I'm in P12 right now. I'm gonna gain some more spots though. Put this up just because the uh, chief complained about it for a second, and I'm not caught in traffic right now or anything, so. Outside. Seventh place does a good job, just hold the line. That's all you can really ask for. Let people find them their way around you. I've seen his name plenty, I'm sure he knows what he's doing. Another pit right there, he chooses the uh, stay on the track pit entry method. There's the 11, that's the guy who was directly behind us, wasn't he? So I feel like we're gaining a little bit of time, but he's gonna have fresher tires, so. Where am I? Why am I all the way down here? That was a stupid way to take that corner. I need to pay attention. 
definitely want to be higher up the track than that so you can turn down better on exit. I guess I just was not paying attention enough. Again, lots of stuff to, take, to, to keep track of here, okay? <laughs> the 12, we were also racing there. Let's see how much he's able to catch up. Darlington stripe yet. We'll correct that if I go the whole race without <laughs> getting one. Gotta leave here with a Darlington stripe. But there's still plenty of time for me to do it by accident, too. Oh, someone lost connection. I don't remember if I was racing around. Here. But some people just now pitting. I feel like that's gonna be a lot of time lost. I don't know if they can make it all back up before the end of this one. I'm pretty happy with where we chose to pit. I do think an undercut works pretty well here. A track with this much speed. Uh, gain, some fresh tires. But we will see. Seventh place. Feels pretty good still, but it'll fall off. There's the guy that was in first and yeah, pit road right now. The 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 lead lead up. Up. No, he's not. Thanks, Carlos. We have anyone flying up on us? We will have the guy that pit on lap 52 coming up and passing us, I imagine. The guy that was the leader. He's only four seconds back, so he's gonna get here in a flash, I bet. And behind him, lap 50, which is eight lap fresher tires. He'll probably catch us as well. We are sixth now. Might even out well for us regardless. We'll see. Never know if anyone had any issues as well. It's a tough pit road, so could have had someone Missing it or getting a penalty. It's always possible. I feel like everyone has picked by now. In fifth, alright. We are in fifth. The gap behind has now decreased to two point eight. Feeling pretty good about a top ten. I think I'd be happy with that. Just getting the top ten. I'm gonna get past a couple times more. I think I can probably keep that top 10. That lap was at 30.6, and the guy behind has just done a 29.4. 1 1.5 behind us. He's catching real quick, as predicted. Yeah, he's like he just cut that in half in one set of corners. You've just done that thirty point six. P five. Thank you, Betty. Car inside. I didn't even need to slow down for him, he just flew by me, so that's a nice easy transaction at least. P6. Alright, Colton, gaining on this car. The gap is 0.2. We got down even there, lap traffic. Maybe. A little bit close to the wall there, we're fine. All calculated. I was not worried for even a second. I was worried for a second. But don't tell him. Don't tell me. Thank you.
So we got 1.8 behind us. He's probably going to catch us before the end of this one, but then six seconds back behind him. So we'll see how that works. Actually, you know what? I think we had a much better pit stop. Yo, than take the it in the inside. Sure, take it on the inside. Thank you, buddy. Thank you. He was ahead of us, I think. And he hit only two laps after us. I need to pay attention. I missed my marks there because I was looking at gaps and things, and that is not what I need. So, I need to pay attention to the track. What about crew, crew Chief, who's supposed to be the one figuring this all out for me? <laughs> but, uh, yeah, so long as I stop doing what I just did. my mark in one and two might have been frustrating to him but I didn't have it on purpose. It's because I was looking at him actually that I missed my mark. You can go here, Alec. Oh shoot, that's a wall. There is the Darlington stripe. That's okay, that's allowed. We weren't trying until we got that. Now we're trying. Probably trying too hard trying to lose the uh, spot to the 10. You know what, I think he's gonna get us anyway, even though I think we had a better pit stop, because he was much better long run last time. So even if we gain some time on him through the pit stop cycle, I think he's still gonna overtake us eventually. But the 12 back there, he's gotta gain a lot of time. I think we might be able to hold on to that. keep falling further and I keep saying we'll be okay and then another person passes us that's all right like I said top 10 is kind of the goal I think I can probably pull that off still truck's just getting real tight especially out of uh, two there Tins coming fast. In fact, a couple of people are arriving pretty fast. Maybe I'll get past a handful of times. I don't know. I'm a little less confident as I watch their gaps go down more and more. Sixteen to go now. Seventh position. Your last lap time was at thirty-one point five. That's not feeling too good. Thank you. Any time, driver. Anyone shifting in three and four? I'm not experimenting with that, so I'm not going to be doing it. But I do wonder. much faster, he gained a ton on me, and I mean, just look how much faster it is than 3 and 4. So we are 8th right now. 
I think the 12 is probably going to catch us, but then I think we're good. <laughs> like I said before, we're kind of moving the goalposts a little bit. But I think, uh, yeah, we should be definitely fine past that point. Behind us, seven lap fresher tires. I believe he was ahead of me for pit stops anyway. Or right behind us, one of the two, I remember his name. So that's all good and well. So ninth place, maybe? The car behind is catching the gaps now, 0.9. Kind of awkward corner right there. Couldn't quite get it to turn how I wanted. Oh wow, he's got a full head of steam. Inside. Still there. There he goes. Nothing I can do about that. Head to go. This time, Mark. Head to go. Almost got another stripe. We got our stripe, though. We don't need any more. <laughs> One per customer, please. Ten had some movement up there. I don't know if he hit the wall or just got loose or something. Wish my truck were getting loose right now. It's definitely not loose at any point. But about seven seconds behind us. Feeling good. Feeling like that's pretty sustainable. This sucks. I would lose 15 I rating for finishing here. Come on now, it's a 3.4 straight to the field. And a ninth, that's a five truck. I'm gonna lose from that? I feel like this is a good finish. Whatever, it doesn't matter. I feel like this is a good finish. It doesn't bring the context of like having a free setup to being at that disadvantage. As much as that's worth, probably less than I give credit for. My back's pretty stiff. This is a, it's a workout driving Darlington, that's for sure. Okay, Colton, that's good consistency. Keep it up. Come oh, back more. Oh my god. <laughs> I think you probably saw that. <laughs> because I record my screen. Uh, tried to rid of the dash, actually. Not do whatever that was. Well, that was a this guy's a lap track, you can wait. For the right opportunity. Which is not right here, by the way. Good run. Alright, down in. Inside. We can do that instead then, fine. Still there. Clear inside. And I hit the correct button this time. Yes, thank you. Five. Five to go. Sometimes you gotta just keep your composure in your race truck. That means whenever you get pop-ups in your face, on your uh, helmet's visor, you gotta know how to get that out of the way. <laughs> Something all drivers deal with. Gotta be ready. Gotta be ready for anything. So, four to go, unless I start riding the wall all the way around the track. I think I should be okay to hold on to this spot. So, no mistakes, probably back it down a little bit. 
No reason to uh, push too hard and KO my truck into the wall or something. There's the number one back there. Should be able to stay on the lead lap though. That's another moral victory. That's worth something. Got two laps to go. At least to me it is. The gap behind has now decreased to 4.7. He's catching up back there, but I don't think he has enough time. Alright, so he's got the right flag back there, no surprise cautions. We give ourselves a second dart into the strike. Wow, matching. That was barely anything though, you probably can't even see it. I bet no paint even came off the truck. You can't prove it. <laughs> so, one to go! White flag, no one to go. That lap was at 31.9. Thank you. I think I went way too slow on pit entry and just gave me too much time there. I think you just stayed out too long. Well, that on top of that. Yeah, I hit the wall on the last lap. You're I'm gonna pay attention to what they were saying. Like, oh, I wonder when they pit and like what they're saying about it. <laughs> Three Darlington stripes. P9. Count them. The one, the two, black, three, black. Black. Great job. You did really well. All right, ninth place. That's good. I'll take it. Give him the old GRGW. Oh, my hands hurt. 6083, pretty similar to the first run. All right. I guess there were only 19 people. That probably has to do with why we're losing, even though we uh, finished ninth. But I don't feel too bad about that at all. I'll take it. Let's uh, see what happened. I guess it's just going to be a whole bunch of wall hits, though, if I had to guess. Maybe we'll see what brought the caution out. Just go real quick, zoom through it. I almost got taken out right there. Got um, kind of coming up off that bottom lane. Interesting. So this guy did the glitch to get in the back and then ran someone up. It was pretty net, Cody. But I think he might have been going on his way to hit him anyway. I question that method. I gotta say, start all the way to the back and then run into the back of somebody. I'm not so sure about that strategy. Moving right along. I think it's probably just going to be wall hits from here on out. Even when they're side by side, I think it's probably most of the time just someone getting in the wall trying to give room. We are all the way on lap 15 already. 16's making a habit out of it. They got pretty good right there. There's me. Yeah, I don't know if we're going to see much else. There were no cautions beyond that point. We had a nice green flag pit stop. I think I did okay green flag pit stop, even though I think I cycled out in like the same spot, if not worse, but... <laughs> Felt like I did what I needed to do, at least. Yep, just gonna be uh, wall hits from here on out, I think. So I guess I'll just slowly go through these. 
maybe try to find some incidents, but I think that's all we're gonna get. So I guess I will just say thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed some nighttime Darlington action in the trucks. We got a, a, a trio of stripes. It was all in like the second half of the race too, I think, wasn't it? Probably just me pushing a little harder made that happen. But uh, nothing too major, didn't smack the wall too hard. There's a guy getting real close to me up there. But yeah, I think it's just wall hits. Ooh, we got someone on uh, pit entry getting sideways and around. I wonder if that was a spot for us. That guy was running well, and then he dragged the wall, so I don't know. He was pitting pretty early, too. Oh, wow, 10. That's probably why we gained so much on him. Man, and he still came and passed me, too, after all this. Do I actually stink, secretly? <laughs> Not so secret? Maybe. He was pretty fast, though, to be fair. He had very good long run pace. Probably because he was getting on the right rear, huh? That was awkward. That little exchange. And both of these people. No, this, uh, the 18 didn't beat me. He was right behind me. Hmm. So we had some interesting stuff happen, not just wall hits. That guy got the wall, and the 7 had to evade. Ten with a little bit more trouble, it looks like. Nah, it's just fake wall hit. Got uh, lap trucks trying to stay out of the way. Oh, excuse me. These incidents are making me yawn, so I think that'll be it. Is me? Oh, that was a harder hit than I remember. I got it pretty good. That's a real Darling's, Darlington stripe. That counts. Yeah, it just didn't turn. Real tight setup. A little tighter than I would like. Right. Moving along. We'll break it if we have to. Oh, we're near the end of the race now. Lap 78. Yep, that's it. All right, thanks for watching. I appreciate you. We get ourselves to P9 after starting P8. I'll take it, and I will see you next time.